This presentation is about indicators, that is, the things that tell you that positive change is happening as a result of the activities that your group is delivering. You need indicators to help you understand if your work is making a difference to the people you work with, and also to help demonstrate this to the others you need to convince, like funders or partners. Indicators illustrate the difference that you are making in the lives of the people you support and that your ways of working are the right ones that are effective and worth investing in. All of this can demonstrate that your project is good value for money. It can be useful to use indicators to show the different stages of a project's development just like the stepping stones in crossing a river. So if your outcome is about improving the health and well-being of people in your community, then the indicators could be good attendance at the drop-in, which is one of your project outputs, that people are visibly enjoying themselves, perhaps through the use of something like photographs, that people have made friends and tell you the value that this has had for them and that they tell you that the whole experience has made them feel more positive about their lives. It's important to understand that there are different types of indicators. Some indicators are easy to measure because you can count them and show them to others. For example, the number of people attending your advice sessions or the numbers your project supports to use other local services. These are known as hard indicators and the numbers give a very clear picture to people about what is happening. The other kind of indicators are more about the experiences of people taking part in using your services. For example, do people feel more socially connected or more positive as a result of taking part in your group's activities? They're harder to record in terms of impact of how people feel they benefit. They are known as soft indicators and you can capture people's experiences using simple methods like video recordings, photographs and quotes of how people feel. As well as using hard or soft indicators separately, you can combine them and use them together. So, if you're capturing the experiences and testimony of people who use your services, thinking about these at scale in terms of the numbers of people who use your service over a particular period, say a year, will start to give you insights into the differences it's making not only for the individual users, but for your community as a whole. This will provide a deeper understanding of the difference you make to people's lives individually and collectively and how many people are benefiting from it. Overall, this will give you a sense of the impact of your project and its value to those who fund and support it.